Now, now, now. If there is a fight in Naruto, we're all dying to see that won't actually happen. Because, of course, only in this YouTube channel will you see something so insane and out of touch with reality, your brain might actually explode. It isn't Kakashi vs. Guy, or Itachi vs. Pain, or I don't know, a rematch between Gara and Rock Lee with none of that, hey, I'm a crush your leg and end this fight bullshit. Actually, Rock Lee has a loaded shotgun with infinite ammo, prep time, and Gara is blind for the first 10 seconds of the fight to make it a little fair. What fight do we want to see in Naruto? It has to be. Kiba vs. Akamaru. And right now, you're probably asking, what the hell am I even watching? What the fuck is going on here? Out of all the potential fights in Naruto, you're picking Kiba vs. a dog, his dog, matter of fact, to fight in a death match? Do you guys know where you are right now? You're in Skits and Giggles Land, the most insane YouTube channel in 2024, and you're watching versus battles done wrong. I promise it will be worth your watch. You just have to give me some time to make a good case because believe me, after I'm done talking, there wouldn't be a more hype fight you would want to watch than Kiba vs. Akamaru. I swear on everything sacred and holy. I swear on my Ocarina of Time cartridge. Now, for this fight to even be possible, some shit has to go down between Kiba and Akamaru in the first place. For example, Kiba gets home one day and he's in a bad mood, Akamaru does the usual, hey, I've missed you all day, and he runs up to him and starts licking his face and shit, and Kiba isn't having any of it. He whips out a belt and starts hitting Akamaru with it viciously, and you know what happens when you take the belt out on a dog or a pet? You've loved your entire life. That animal will lose all its love and trust for you in one nanosecond. Akamaru's entire concept of love and loyalty will shatter right there and then, and oh boy, his love will turn into confusion, and that trust that was forever there will turn into hatred and disdain. That's our motive. Kiba brings out the belt and whips Akamaru to death, or almost death. I say to death because he might even end up killing Akamaru. It could happen. Maybe Kiba's rampage escalates. He even takes out a gun after and shoots Akamaru point blank a couple of times or he hops on a tractor and runs in over, over, and over again. He can go completely insane. And that's it right there, folks. It's 1-0 for Kiba. But on the other hand, Akamaru can escape through a window if Kiba doesn't kill him, and he hides in a cave or in the sewers of Konoha for a few days until he heals, and then you bet that dog is going to come up with something mischievous. The more he thinks of that belt coming closer to him, and the sound of that whip... <laughs> And how much it hurts, the more his vendetta grows. And you know what it's like in anime. His hatred is going to mutate a breed of saliva deadlier than a Komodo's dragon venom. And with just one bite, bam, you're fucking dead in five minutes tops. He's gonna wait until Kiba lowers his guard and falls asleep. He's gonna come in the room and just bite a leg or his neck or someplace easy to reach quickly. And that's it. Kiba's gonna be like, oh shit, it's round two, baby, only to realize he can't move anymore and he's blacking out. Akamaru's going to watch how Kiba dies slowly with an evil grin on his face and he's gonna yell, that's what you get for hitting me with a belt, bitch. Take that. The final score, one for one. Who's gonna be next? Who do you guys wanna watch fight in versus battles done wrong? Is it Sakura versus Hinata? Is it the ramen guy versus the fourth Hokage? Or something even more ludicrous and insane? Let me know in the comments below. And if you've reached this far, which would be a miracle, smash like, smash subscribe, smash like again, and smash subscribe until you're subscribed 20 times. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, have a good day.